Charlie could rock it up into the sky Nothing can stop me tonight And I even feel What's going on there everyone? I am Sebastian Mammoth aka Iron Man 2.0 and today I'm going to be reviewing the Playmates Godzilla x Kong toys Godzilla Kong and the other Titans got for me. We got Suko with Titanus Doug, Battle Roar Scar King, Godzilla vs. Shimo, and Kong vs. Scar King. You know the ish kebabble by now. Let's get started. Okay, so first up, we will start with Suko and Titanus Doug, since I am interested in that one. Okay, so as you can see right here, it looks much like the battle roar and masks I have. So as you can see right here, it says MonsterVerse, Godzilla X, Kong the New Empire, Suko and Titanus Doug with our two Titans right here. We got Godzilla and Kong over here, Suko and Titanus Doug on the back. Ha! <sighs> And here we have Suko and Titanus Doug with a little bio on Suko right there. Anyway, let's get him out of the package. For this, I'm gonna have one of my friends do this. Hey, Freddy! Ooh, let's see what we have here, my friends. <laughs> oh, a tail. <sighs> okay, let's get this guy out. I got the little monkey out, and I got the rock. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you very much, Freddy. I'll take it from here. Okay, so here is the package without Suko and Doug inside. Suko with Doug, Mumbo Jumbo, the two boys here, and then the crystals, the pink lemonade. And we have Suko over here with the bio, which I'll just... Put right here for you so you can read it on your own time and the little plot line right here for the film and down here we can see scar king with whiplash which i don't have yet shimo which i don't have either godzilla with heat ray kong with beast glove which i don't have either and godzilla evolved let's get to the toys now hiya suko and doug so I was actually surprised to find out that doug is going to be in godzilla and kong the new empire here and I, of course, had to get this guy as well. And if y'all don't know, we first saw Doug in Godzilla vs. Kong killing a mantle claw. And here is the Suko figure that looks like me because he has green eyes and red fur. And uh, if y'all don't know, uh, Playmates actually changed it a bit. These figures here don't have battle damage, like, at all. Looking at the back of Doug, this is actually the first Doug figure I have. This is actually rather, rather nice. I like how Playmates put up every detail. And to me, this looks like a sign that he's grown a little bit. And for Suko's articulation, it's his head, which can move all the way around. His arms, his arms, and his torso. His legs and knees. But there's no articulation in his feet for some odd reason. For Doug's articulation, it's his head, his legs, his backwards legs and tail. And it doesn't even need any tail assembly. And here's Suko's little accessory being a rock. This is actually not bad for a little figure, which this is a sign that Suko is probably being in training right now. And yeah, that was the six inch fig. That's the six inch Suko with Titanus Doug figure. But now, Let's get to Scar King. Alright, so here is Battle Roar Scar King with his whiplash, and as you may have noticed, this may look like he's offering you a fist bump. But as you can see, it says God Battle Roar Scar King, Godzilla X, Kong the New Empire with our two boys right here. Same side here, same side here with the Battle Roar Titans. And we have Scar King, Kong, and Godzilla who's not featuring the red on the back of his tail. Why? Who the hell knows? I do have these two figures which are right over there. But I'll get to that in a moment. But now, let's get Scar King out of the box. And to do it this time, I have called in another friend of mine. Ugoji! Alright, what do we have here? Time to whip him out. Ugh. I got him out of the package. These cords are very hard. I'm out. 
Sorry about that, guys. I feel bad for Godzilla. He doesn't even want to unbox boxes anymore. I, I had to, like, do, do this just one time. Huh? Anyway, real quick. Here's the box. It looks like Kong's, except, you know, Scar King, but uh, that's not important right now. So, let's get to Scar King, shall we? Here he is. The one. The only. Scar King. So when it comes to Scar King's design, it looks actually nice. The blue eyes, the the skin, the fur. But unfortunately, the whiplash here... Oh. It looks like it was supposed to be removable, but surprisingly it isn't for some reason. It's just glued in. I guess that's just a playmate's mistake or something. For Scar King's articulation, it's his arms, his hands, when he first came in the package in the mail from Kong, this one looked like he was offering you a fist bump. And his legs, but not his feet for some reason. And his mouth if you're not planning to use the figure so long. So, for his gimmick, just like Kong, there's a button right here. Oh my god, look at this. Playmates got sussy again. There's two screw holes on his, on his bottom. But anyway, for his gimmick, there's a button on the back here and you're going to want to... And he'll unleash, he'll, he'll unleash his authentic roar sounds. And he goes perfectly with the battle roar Godzilla and Kong. And this looks actually nice. Yeah, I wish the entire whiplash was removable, but really good. It's really great. Greater than ever. But now, let's get to the, to the dioramas. Here we have... Godzilla vs. Shimo, Kong vs. Scar King, our two favorite monsters meeting yet again in cinemas to fight these bad boys and girl, this, this bad boy and girl, March 29th, 2024, and I know exactly which one we should start with. One of my best nude favorite dioramas of all. We're starting with Kong and Scar King first since I am most interested in that one, so Goji and Shimo, take the back seat please. So, here is the front of the box with Kong and Scar King and here is Kong right there and a, and a new official photo of Scar King himself which looks very terrifying and creepy. Godzilla x Kong the New Empire exclusive figures Godzilla and Kong together here the diorama ha! and here is the back with a lava set which is very interesting and some crystal figures and the new biomimic heave and the bottom, it comes what you, what you have, and the Godzilla vs. Shimo diorama, which we'll get into in a second. So, let's get them out of the box. So, while I'm unboxing this, if you all don't know, it seems that Walmart and Target are, are taking turns, turns by sharing Godzilla and Kong merchandise. So you all didn't know that. Uh, 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 hang on a minute. So like I was saying, Walmart and Target are taking turns with this stuff, so yeah, this looks pretty nice. Okay, so here are the diorama, here's the diorama, but I'm gonna have someone else cut these open. Kong, if you will, buddy. I will have happy to open for you, Sebastian. Give me the scissors. Oh, I got a new heave. How many of these guys do you plan on buying, Sebastian? Honestly, Kong, way too many. Well, save your money, man. You're honestly really lucky we got you this stuff. Alright, I got Scar King out. Now, it's time to get me out of the package. Hey, Kong, out of curiosity, what what's up with you and Lady Kong? She's, uh, kind of freaking out because they think, like, she thinks I'm gonna get killed off in the film. Which I won't, thank god. Oh, that's sad. We should sing her a lullaby to calm her down. Oh, don't worry. I just need to find the right time to comfort her first. Oh, that's a Alright. I got me out of the package. I'll see you all in a few minutes. Time to go take my banana break. I feel bad for Kong. He's been waiting for the trailer since New Year's Day. I've been... I've wanted to... I'll have another trailer out tonight, huh? Anyway, let's get to the figures now, huh? Here's the diorama they come with, which I'll assemble at my own, my own time. 
So let's take a look at Scar King first. As you can see, he, he's already been uh, battle damaged, which is in the form of some kind of black fur, which I think could be the smoke or the lava or something like that. And here is the whiplash it comes with, which is detachable and reattachable as well. His articulation is his head, his arms, his torso for the first time, his legs and knees, but there's no articulation in his feet either. As you saw earlier, here is the whiplash, which looks to be in the form of a dead warbat body, which it is, and we just don't know that yet. But it can snap itself on and snatch itself off, which uh, is really great. And here is Kong himself, all dressed in orange and red, with his brand new beast glove. His articulation is the same as the Kongs in the GVK line, but... I want to put something to the test. I want to see if Atomic Axe is compatible with this Kong right here, which, um, let me line it up with the hand right here real quick. Oh no! It appears Atomic Axe is not compatible with this Kong. <sighs> but looking at the back of Kong anyway, it looks like there's nothing right here. Looking at the Beast Glove, this thing looks pretty cool. Yeah, people are mistaking it as the Infinity Gauntlet, but wow, this thing is amazing. I can't believe my eyes. And it comes with an accessory being the, the Biomimic Heave Hev, the new and improved Hollow Earth Anti-Gravity Vehicle. And as you saw, this looks nothing compared, like nothing compared to the Godzilla vs. Kong Heave with the, the one that the Skull Crawler came with, but Looks really cool and amazing. You know, that Scar King figure looks nothing like the original Six Sense, which I hope to find soon. The Kong figure is pretty nice, and that lava set, which I'll put together soon, is amazing. But now, let's get to the other side of the course. Let's get to Godzilla versus Shimo. Godzilla and Shimo, the titans that are going to meet in cinemas for the first time March on March 29, 2024. So as you can see, it has Godzilla right here with an awesome photo of Shimo, which I think is very, very nice. Yeah, I mean, she's stuck, she's stuck in a gender debate, but I'm just gonna wait till the trailer comes out. And for now, I'm just gonna refer to Shimo as a female. But now, let's get Kong over here. Hey, Kong! Don't worry, I'm on it. <sighs> I got the tail. I'll see you guys next time. I feel bad for Kong again. Anyway, let's get to attaching the tails. So here is Shimo herself. Now, first things first. First, let's get her tail on. Oh no, oh no. I think I'm getting NECA flashbacks. I think I'm gonna have to use some hot water or hair dryer for this. Hang on a second, guys. Okay, Shimo's tail was very easy. And up front, she doesn't look very bad. So her, her articulation is her jaw, her head, which is on a ball joint, move up and down, all the way around, and side to side a little bit. Her legs, her ankles for the very first time, and her tail, which is on a ball joint, and she stands perfectly. And here is the frostbite blast she comes with, which for purposes, we can just put it in the cavity and oh my god, I don't like how this is looking. Oh, just put it in her mouth. There we go. She'll shoot her frostbite blast. Now, let's put on Godzilla's tail. Hopefully it is much easier than Shimo's. Those come... Ugh. Oh, okay, that works. This one is very easy. So up front here is Godzilla himself, all dressed in blue and dark blue and red. And here is the atomic blast he comes with, which we can just easily put it in his mouth like that, or maybe like this. This, ooh, I don't know how this is gonna work for me. Oh, okay, there we go. Fits in his mouth, right, right like that. And look at that, pretty cool, huh? And also good news, it's compatible with the GVK heat rays and proton screen right here, so you can easily, you know. And up front, uh, it appears that this one's eye is a bit out of place. Out of place and funny looking. This side's, this eye's not bad though. 
But up front, though. <laughs> his articulation is his jaw, a bit of his head, which I don't think it's supposed to move, his arms, legs, his ankles, and tail, which is side to side, up and down, and 360 if you want to or feel like it. Well, I think that's it. Uh, that's all the toys for now. Uh, the Godzilla vs. Shimo, Kong vs. Scar King, Suko with Titanus Doug, Battle Roar Scar King for you all. Be sure you like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Have a good day or night, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.